When we talk about Jamaica, we tend to focus on the music, food, natural attractions and other elements of the culture. Today, however, I want to highlight the island's biodiversity, specifically our animals. Jamaica is blessed with a diverse wildlife. Jamaica is the home to several species of animals. Some animals are endemic to the island, while others can be found in other parts of the world. Birds are definitely one of the most diverse species of animals. In fact, there are approximately 300 species of animals in which around 30 are endemic to the island. By virtue of Jamaica being an island, our marine life holds a wide variety as well. However, is there danger lurking behind the exotic beauty? Let's talk snakes. The Jamaican boa is the largest of the seven species of snakes on the island. It is capable of reaching 8 to 9 feet in length. While this crawling reptile may appear frightening at first glance, it's not poisonous. In fact, all seven species of snakes on the island are harmless. In truth, despite their appearance and various myths, the majority of Jamaica's animals are relatively harmless. These in Jamaica, um, easily the largest. We have none of which are venomous. So we have no venomous snakes in Jamaica, so you have nothing to worry about there. So these guys aren't venomous. Although the bite could be kind of painful, there's not been any venom there. So. But you should not take that for granted because there are a few creatures that are considered dangerous, especially if you're trespassing into their natural habitats. First, we'll talk about the American crocodiles. Although Jamaicans have the tendency to refer to these large reptiles as alligator, in truth, they're actually crocodiles. Notably, the largest reptile in the island, the American crocodiles, are usually found on the southern coast of the island. These large lizards prefer brackish waters and are found in mangrove swamps. They are not endemic to the island though, as they can also be found in the wetlands of Cuba, Cayman Islands and Florida. In Jamaica, the highest concentration of crocodiles can be found in Black River, located in St. Elizabeth. There have been cases where unsuspecting humans have been fatally attacked by crocodiles. One such person is 67-year-old Wilford Edmondson. Whilst fishing with friends in the Hellshire Pond area of Portmore, Edmondson became the victim of a crocodile attack. This was on August 26, 2018. The croc carried him into the mangroves and inflicted wounds to his head. Tragically, Edmondson died and only a part of his body was recovered. It is also important to note that crocodiles are protected under the Wildlife Protection Act. Thus, it is an offense to have a crocodile or a part of a crocodile in your possession. I was working at my electrical table. Just feel a little stressed out and just feel to work and fresh my brain. At that moment, I end up with a, what do I call it now? By stand, go, go there standing at the edge of the water, about two feet from the water. I only just feel something like a piece of wood just bunks me, bunks me on my foot. And next thing, I only feel water going up to, up to my throat. So the best thing my understanding would know, tell me say, close your breath and go down, and I was, af the timing feel like about, about five minutes or more on the water. I don't know if I was spinning. Sharks. Some of the most dangerous animals are actually found underwater. Amongst the list of dangerous aquatic animals are sharks. Sharks that are found in Jamaican waters are those that prefer to inhabit warm waters. These include Caribbean reef sharks, nurse sharks, tiger sharks, hammerhead sharks, and bull sharks. There have been very few shark attacks and most occur in deep waters, such as the case with the death of Nicholas Malcolm. The shark attack occurred in St. Mary on September 19, 2018, where Nicholas Malcolm, a fisherman, was killed. 
Malcolm was underwater fishing at the famous James Bond beach with a friend when he was attacked. Jellyfish. So while the jellyfish is not as dangerous as sharks and crocodiles, an encounter with a jellyfish can still cut your beat trip really short. This seemingly jelly-like creature is known for inflicting painful stings to unsuspecting swimmers. In 2010, four individuals were reported to have been stung by jellyfish at the Turtle Towers. Puerto Seco and Priory beaches. While none of the victims received life-threatening injuries, one of the victims described the injury as severe burning of the skin after being stung. Stingrays, another aquatic animal you may want to stay clear from are stingrays. As the stingray glides through the crystal waters, it appears somewhat calm. However, once disturbed, a stingray can pack a wicked sting. Most stingray attacks occur when the animal is stepped on. It defends itself by stabbing its stinger, which is at the base of its tail, into its victim. It can be very difficult to pinpoint the sea creature's location since it can camouflage itself under the sand. However, there hasn't been any reported attacks from stingrays. And in fact, you can actually have a one-on-one -on -one encounter with these sea creatures at the Dolphin Cove. But don't worry, their barbs are removed. Let's get back on land and talk pit bulls. Although pit bulls are treated as household pets, they have a reputation for being extremely dangerous. While it's not frequent, pit bull attacks are not rare in Jamaica. In fact, in the past, the animal has been known to attack strangers and their owners alike. In 2012, a two-year-old girl was killed by a pit bull in St. Catherine. In that same year, a mother and her 14-month-old son were also attacked. Despite this fact, it is not illegal to purchase the animal, once done with the necessary permits. As such, the police have warned owners to keep their animal properly secured in order to prevent it from getting into contact with the public. Passerbys are asked to take extreme precaution when approaching premises where pit bulls are being kept. The Scorpion Fish the scorpion fish is very striking and some people call it stonefish or rockfish. Whatever the name is, it is important to note that the scorpion fish is one of the most venomous fish in the world and what this fish lacks in beauty, it makes up in venom. The scorpion fish is a master of disguise and its mottled pinkish gray form makes it very difficult to see as it lies still amongst the rocks. Therefore, we have divers accidentally stepping on them. When the venomous spines pierce the skin, the victim will experience pain spreading along the stung limb. Such injuries can be fatal if medical help is not provided immediately. The brown recluse spider, it is also known as the violin spider or fiddleback spider. This is because of the violin shaped markings at the top front body section. It may be the deadliest of all the animals in Jamaica, not just because of its aggressive nature, but also because of its bite, which has a powerful venom that destroys red blood cells, causing generalized tissue damage. Brown recluse spider likes to live in discreet dark areas in rooms and boxes and rarely worn clothes and shoes. The recluse spiders only bite when threatened, especially when trapped in clothing like in the case of one unlucky woman who encountered the recluse in her bedsheets. If ever bitten, you are to seek medical attention immediately. Giant centipede this absolutely terrifying creature is known locally by 40 leg it is the largest centipede species in the world 
and every local in Jamaica knows how to stay clear of it. They are unpleasant animals to be around and they can creep up on you noiselessly into any corner. The 40 leg bite injects a potent toxin that can be lethal in humans. People who this giant centipede has attacked experience swelling cramps and may die. So in Jamaica, we all know, you must stay far away from giant centipedes as much as possible. And if you're bitten, seek medical help immediately. Look at that. Hold on, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. So we are at the end of the video and I hope that you all enjoyed it. Let me know in the comment section below which of these animals are you most afraid of? I am most afraid of the centipede. Since I was a child, I want nothing to do with them. <laughs> Anyways guys, please like, share, subscribe and comment. And I will see you all in the next video. Until then, take care of your nice, clean, beautiful selves. One love. Bye. Thank you.